Hi guys, JC here. Welcome back to another edition of Horse Racing Preview. <laughs> this week's feature comes to us from the fairgrounds, so that must only mean one thing. Yep, it's time again for the, the Comet Stakes. <laughs> Guys, this here is race 13 from the fairgrounds. Set for a mile and 16th all on the main track. It is restricted to three-year-olds and carries a purse of $200,000. So let's get started right away, guys. And here's who I like. I'm like an Arabian prince to win this one. <laughs> you know, still, once again this week, we're looking for the obvious chalk beater. And I really think I found it with Arabian prince here. This horse, you know, has a lot of the P word. Potential. <laughs> Let me explain what I mean. He has a lot of the key names going for him. You know, he's trained by Dallas Sewer. He has Brian Hernandez up. So that's one thing to look for right there. But I also like how it seems to be able to make closing efforts. You know, last time out of Churchill, he ran from eight down to finish third. And that's not bad, you know. He didn't lose by much overall. It's like a length or two. So I feel, with, you know, with that being said, I feel like if this horse can bring it just a split second sooner, you know, he has all the potential in the world to come out on top and beat this chalk on Saturday, you guys. Oh, by the way, Saturday happens to be my birthday. <laughs> no, guys, seriously. But, um. Uh, no, Arabian Prince all the way on top on Saturday. <laughs> Guys, moving right along. I am liking Santa Cruz in a run second. Now, this here, he is another one that I feel like can pull him all upset. Um, you know, both these horses are more in line 6 to 1, so I'm talking mild upsets here versus your chalk at 3 to 1. Um, but seriously, you guys, Santa Cruiser, uh, I, you know, I like that this horse, one minute he's closing, you know, one race he's closing, the next race he's wiring him. So, you know, he's one of my pants and does what he wants to horses. <laughs> uh, seriously, you guys. And... You know, you're looking at different things when you're looking at a race or handicapping a race. And I feel like this this distance is not a problem for this one. You know, we went a mile last time out of wire and gate to wire. And, um, I mean, it really is going to be a surprise to me what kind of running style that Santa Cruiser brings. You know, but there's no reason why, why you can't include him in your exotics, you know. You got James Graham up, and James Graham is his jock, and he's been there the entire time. So... I think all is good in the hood with this one, <laughs> guys. And rounding out your top three, I am liking Mandaloon. Now, I mean, I really like how he ran in his first start. He closed like a banshee from nine down to steal a Vic, you know. And and that's you know that was at seven furlongs. Um, I mean, there's not, not too much you can say wrong about this horse. I just wonder if maybe the little extra distance might be a little too much for him. I don't know. We'll have to wait and see. <laughs> but So right now, for just in case purposes, I got him running third. And of course, you know, your guys' JC upset special, Red and Wild. <laughs> guys, I've said before, I'll say it again. If you like what you see and I know that you do, please click subscribe, ring my bell so you never ever miss a video. Pass my video down the street to someone who's going to also click and ring and like and enjoy. <laughs> So they never ever miss a video as well. And you guys, if you want to visit me on Facebook, please come. Facebook.com slash JC's Horse Racing Preview. And I'll catch you next week. Bye.